<coughs> right, some congratulations on the win Friday night in Singapore. We're a couple of days past the event now. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling fine. I'm feeling awesome. I'm back to trying my best to recover as fast as I could. What do you do to recover? Uh, small fitness things, you know, and then eating a lot. Eating a lot, getting that energy back in your system. Yeah, yeah. What would be a, what would be a treat you'd have for food-wise after you've won a fight? Is there anything particularly you eat? Sorry? Is there anything particularly you like to eat that you don't normally eat because you're training, but after you've won a fight, you you, you thought you've earned it? I want to get as much as a steak as possible. Yeah. <laughs> and looking back on your fight, how, how do you feel your performance went? I'm happy with my performance, but uh, I'm much more happier if I was able to take him down on the ground and show, show to the world my improvements in BJJ. How tough was it to get him down and how tough was it fighting someone that tall? It's very, very tough. It's my first time and I'm not used to its range. Most especially, I have a 5'7 five, or 5'8 five, eight, five, eight tall. That's the tallest training partner I can afford here in our place. That's why it's hard to find six-footer in, in the mountains. I was going to ask you that. Who is the tallest person you could train with? Was there anyone close to being six foot tall? Uh, Honorio. Honorio. Wow. So what, what, what were the main difficulties with fighting someone that tall? Uh, the difficult thing is the range and, of course, you cannot get close as much as possible because of those knees. You got always advantage with the knees. That's why I have to get in there and get out as much as possible. When it went to the decision, how confident were you that the judges were going to see it your way? 100% I'm confident I got the fight. Yeah, and have you watched it back yet? Yeah, yeah, I watched it. I watched it once. And yeah, what did you think when you watched it back? Sorry? What did you think when you watched it back? Uh, next time I have to do more of wrestling so that I can implement my jujitsu. How much do you watch a fight after you've after the actual fight? Do you watch it back much, win or lose? Sorry? How much do you watch a fight back after you've after a fight? If you've won or lost, do you watch it back a lot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, uh, at first they say I'm gonna fight uh, Ballard, you know? Yeah. They say I'm gonna fight Ballard, and then we prepared for that, and then suddenly from Ballard they change it into a giant, a six foot high guy. So the adjustment was necessary, and the adjustment, the training camp, we really need to focus on other t other stuff and changing my training partners, changing the game plan, and of course changing the, the routines. Oh well. It's quite difficult. Because I was chatting to you on the day after the fights, we were talking about fighting Ballard in the future. I didn't realize there was plans to maybe fight him last weekend. Sorry? So I didn't realize you were originally supposed to fight Gustavo. Yeah, yeah. Right, so we were joking about it the next Next day, so if, if, maybe if you fight him, he's going from the from the tallest guy in the flyweight division to the shortest but, guy. But I think Leon, it's a good fight, right? It's a good match. If I try also my best with with Ballard, well, we, the way he performed, he amazed me when he competed with with Wada the last time in Japan. Yeah, well, we think that I think that would be a fantastic matchup. Awesome, Have awesome. Have you spoke to one championship about that fight? Maybe trying to make. Not again? yet, not yet, but not yet, but maybe we're looking forward into that fight. And obviously there's a card coming up in Manila in August. Do you think that might be a good time for you to come back or is that a little bit too soon? Yeah, I can get back. I'm good. No injuries. Just a little swelling and you know, I can I can I can get back up in training in just after two weeks. Uh, uh, when do you well so you'll you'll start training again in two weeks time? Do you have a little rest after a fight? Uh, maybe I rest this week, then I get back on next week. How's the body feeling today? Feeling still sore, but I'm used to it. 
Oh, there you are. Well, thanks for talking to us. We hope we can see them, you versus Gustavo Balak. That would be a fantastic matchup. And as we were saying on Saturday, it'd be quite fun to go from sort of fighting up there to fighting down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, Leon. Thank you very much for having cool. me. Thank you. Look forward to Have seeing you back. Have a blessed night, brother. And you, you take care. Thank you. Yeah. Bye-bye.